At Bev Francis Powerhouse Gym in Syosset, New York, Kai Green, the two-time Arnold Classic champion, is working to change his resume and add Mr. Olympia to his list of accomplishments. Never too busy for his fans, Kai stops for a moment when approached by a young man looking to tell Kai what an impact he's made on his life. Ryan Racklin has traveled all the way from Virginia to train here at the East Coast Mecca of Bodybuilding on the slim chance that he would get to meet his idol, Kai Green. Today, his gamble pays off. I was in the military and I wasn't too happy. And I got into Kai uh, during a deployment. He made me realize that it's so natural to be yourself when you're by yourself. But when you're surrounded by people or in an, in an environment where you're not comfortable, that it's still okay to be yourself. I, he told me that sometimes we need an external source to tap into making our own choices. And I just thanked him for being my external source. He said he was touched. It was cool. Had like a tear in his eye a little bit. He also told me that it wasn't him that did anything. Uh, it was me by the choices I made, typical Kai. At 10 weeks out, Kai seems to be on top of his game. He has not allowed himself to get too far out of contest shape during his offseason, and some of those who have seen recent photos are already saying he will win bodybuilding's biggest contest in September. Predictions like that are common, but extremely premature. Both Kai and the reigning champion, Phil Heath, would be the first to agree. But that's bodybuilding. However, it's clear from just looking at Kai's physique 10 weeks out that he truly believes he is on a path to greatness and wants to demonstrate that to the world. Surely, Phil Heath knows how badly Kai wants to beat him and is pounding away at his own body this very minute in an effort to build the walls of his fortress even higher and stave off the attack. Kai knows that the crown that Phil Heath holds is not easily captured, and the work required between standing in this gym and holding the sandal in his hands is formidable. But for Kai Green, there is no other way. The journey he began as a teen in the 1990s is continuing to come to fruition with every set and every rep. <laughs>